Where's the shooter at? The inside? Hey, let's go. For the first time, we're getting a look at the dramatic moments after a deadly shooting inside a Florida Walmart. Body camera video shows first responders arrived to the scene of what they believe is an active shooter situation. I got you, I got you, I got you, I got you, I got you. Andy, you guys are here, Andy, you guys are here. Andy, you guys are here. Boss man, boss man, yo, yo. Andy, you guys are here, Andy, you guys are here. We got you, I promise you guys, you guys are here. I don't know, they shot him, I don't know. Law and Crime Network obtained the nearly 10 hours of body camera footage this week, stemming from the July 19th incident. It happened in a Florida City, Florida Walmart, about an hour southwest of Miami. Witnesses said they heard as many as six gunshots go off before two men were shot and injured. Video shows officers arrive on the scene, gearing up for an active shooter threat, running through the stores with long guns in hand. Where's the shooter at? The inside? Let's go. Is this one open? Hold on! Hold on! Hold on! There goes Andre. Is there one? Ready on smoke and water. Video shows an officer approach the nail salon inside Walmart, where one victim, later identified as 22-year-old Nathaniel Baez, is laying on the ground. A woman can be heard screaming and praying for help. Stay with me, stay with me, stay with me. Come on, wake up, buddy. Come on, stay with me. Stay with me, stay with me. Please, please, Lord, I beg you. I beg you, please. Stay with me, stay with me. Nate, Nate, please stay with us, Nate. A second victim was shot and injured by a stray bullet but survived. Baez, however, died as a result of his injuries. Officials later determined an argument had broken out between two groups of three people each before the shooting. At some point, a gun was drawn and fired at Baez. His relative explained the situation to first responders on the scene. We on this tag. You walked the right here paying for our food. You came with two individuals. And they walked up to us. And I'm with my baby, bro. And they walked up to us with my baby in my hand. And they was like, what's up? You trying to jump us? like, bro, we don't know you, bro. He came, bro. He attacked me first. They attacked us first. Do we have customers want to make sure they can leave the building? They, they can leave that way. They, the police are like, they can leave that way. I got you, I got you, I got you, I got you, I got you. Andy, you guys are here, you guys are here. Oh, no, you guys are here. Boss man, boss man, yo, yo. Oh, no, Andy, you guys are here, you guys are here. We got you, I promise you guys, you guys are going to go here. I don't know they shot him, I don't know. Where's the shooter at? The inside? Let's go. Is this one open? Hold on, hold on, hold on. 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 Hold on, hold on, Stay here, stay here, stay here. Alright, sure, you have to disregard that one. 
I got yeah, this way, I got one step. Don't help start your hands. Start. Uh, is there any bolo or description? I got our victim right here. After that, video shows Baez's family breaking down as officials work to secure the situation. Lord Jesus Christ! Go behind the counter, go behind the counter. I get it, I get it. No, bro, no, bro, they shot him for the box. I get you, I get you, I need you guys in the counter. Bro, please, Lord Jesus Christ, be made of my Lord. He shot! Boston, they already have a five fighter to survive. They got him? Yes, but I can't let you guys leave right now. They keep starting something, you guys are still back here. Your family was the one that got shot? Yes, yes, yes. Come on, we have your home city assistant. Check the store now. What are you? Meanwhile, officials search for a suspect, asking witnesses what the gunman looked like. I have a witness. They're saying the subject, one of the subjects, black male by the name of Jamari Hodge. Second subject is an employee of Walmart that was working at Walmart at the time. Just a one subject. What did the Walmart black employee have on? What did it look like? Oh, yeah, dreads. His name's Tito on his tag. Yeah, and he had a blue Walmart shirt on? Yes. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Okay. We got three more coming out the front entrance. Here's the one. Unless they have a subject or someone bleeding where they need rescue, I need everybody to stay off the air. Break. Here, if you want that's for him. Okay. Oh, 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 Bro, he's done, bro. Like, your height or my height? Bro, my height, bro. What, like 5'10? Yeah, bro, skinny, bro. He's back here, bro. Uh, we have it all shut down. Oh, black male with dreads. His name tag, Peter. Not one of the subjects. Come on, Ruffy. Where is he? 6 1. The other subject, Jomari, was for the witness dressed in power black. A uh, short haircut and a uh, scruffy low beard. A uh, black short haircut, scruffy low beard. Eventually, Baez's family is escorted out of Walmart. Let's go this way. Yeah. Yeah. We'll walk yeah. Follow up, please. Come on. I'm going to put you guys in the secure area. Make sure the AC's on high. Yeah. Hey, verifying you have the shooter. So far, with the video shows and witnesses. Correct. Right. How many shooters were there? Not as good. Have a count. Oh, 
Body camera video shows Baez's family again explaining what led up to the deadly shooting. Three little boys walked up to us. I seen them walking towards them. I seen, I seen their demeanor. Turn 25 all three, three all nine all six. I said, what's good? And then like, you're all six. Oh, what's up? 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 During this same time frame, officials tracked down the accused shooter. 25-year-old Steve Leston and take him into custody. Hey, it's only you and shooting, right? Yeah, just me. Just me. Just me. Nobody else in that shooting. Just me. I got you. I got you. Like I said, you're not, you're not getting arrested or rest of nothing. I don't know what's going on. This is a shooter. Yeah, for sure. So you're just being a team. Yeah, though. Did you provide any... But first responders continue to get reports of multiple shooters. I got you, bro. Give me a second. Because they mentioned all the shooters, so we... Guys, go on that side. Go on this side. 20-year-old Roberto Andre Acevedo and 21-year-old Jamari Caston Hodge were also arrested on the scene. They now face battery charges. Video shows Leston maintained, though, he was the only one to fire any shots. Hey, how many people are shooting at? Just you or are yeah. they just me? Uh, come through the McDonald's entrance. Just already here is going through the McDonald's entrance. Any advice for us that additional shooter the description on that subject? Sir, it was only you. 100. I'll just be the vibe. So it'll be three Hispanic males. Three Hispanic males. Shoot. Video then shows Leston going in and out of the squad car before requesting a change with his handcuffs. All right, step out. Eventually, Leston is removed from the scene. Yes. Uh, not too far from here. Hey, do you have anything on else on you I should know about, bro? Because I might handcuff you. Do you have anything else on you I should know about? Because I'm, I'm going to remove the handcuff. He spends about two hours in the back of a squad car before he's removed for the final time. He's asking, can you put the cuff in the front? How many cuffs you got on right now? Two? 
comfortable to make it as comfortable as possible, right? So what? It's, it's not comfortable at all. I'm gonna make it as possible as comfortable as I can. It's not comfortable at all, bro. God damn, I'm scared, bro. Put you on like you bring. Yeah, there you go. Hey, what you see like that? Leston now faces charges of second degree murder and attempted felony murder. Right now, he's being held in the Miami Dade County Jail without bond. Reporting for Long Crime Network, I'm Sierra Gillespie.